Hey, what's up, guys? It's NFL boy Brandon. Um, I'm here today. I'm doing something like uh, like Wardheads. I went out. Uh, I went to three different places. I went to Dollar Tree, uh, Kroger's, and uh, Speedway, all looking for Wardheads, and I could not find them anywhere. Um, so I got these. These are sort of like Wardheads. Um, I'm going to be eating them by the handful, but the problem with that is, is by the handful, they're actually gum inside, but when you eat one or two at a time, you can't tell, so you can swallow that, but with a handful, it's so much in there and so much gum that you can't, so I'm going to be eating them by the handful, but once I get done, I'm going to be going over the layer somewhere so you can't see me and spitting them out, because if I... Because if I swallow that, um, it will um, it will um, back up my system, you know. Um, like uh, fucking gum takes thirty some years to digest inside of you, so yeah, I am not gonna be eating or swallowing these. So I will be eating them. Um, I mean, I will be chewing them, but I'm not gonna be swallowing them. Hang on, let me put my phone on silent and let me test my girlfriend back real quick. Okay, cool, there we go. I don't let her know that I was making a YouTube video real quick. Um but yeah, I I can either I don't know which one I'm going to do yet. I can either eat one or two and swallow them or eat um, a handful and uh, and not. I don't know what I'm going to do yet. Uh, yeah, it's funner. It's funner to see people's reactions when they eat it up fully. So I'm going to eat a whole handful uh, but like I said, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna swallow it. I'm gonna go over there somewhere as to where you guys can't see me, and I'm going to spit it out. So, if you guys don't want to see me spit or, or anything like that, then go ahead and click off the video when you watch it, I guess. Um... But yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing. And I'm going to be answering the questions that I still have left from yesterday. Um, all right. All right, I got a handful. Sort of. I got four, but they're kind of big. All right, here we go. Mm. 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 Hold on, I'm going to back. Alright, hey, I'm back. Um, I got a bag. I'm gonna be spitting into this. Um, but like I said, I'm gonna go over there somewhere where you can't hear me when I do. Um, and sorry about the dog barking.
Sorry. But it's basically how this video is gonna go. Sorry guys, if I would have got some other kind of candy or knew that these was gum, gum I would not have done this. Uh, when it says gummy candy, but when I when I ate them before, it wasn't gummy. Um, it didn't taste like gum. Um, but now, now it does. Uh, if you eat too many, let's see. Um, the first question is. What is the furthest you've ever been from home? Uh, like I told you guys in the last video, the only place I've ever been is California. So I would have to say California. Because um, that's the only place I've ever been. Um, here goes another. Oh shit. Here goes another handful. Mm. Mm. Oh yeah, by the way, uh, something I want to talk to you guys about. Um. Hold on, wait till I get done. Let me walk over here real quick. Alright, something that I wanted to talk to you guys about was that um, I've been doing videos off of my uh, off of my computer lately, and that's what I'm doing this one off of again. Um, and I can't find a good editing app to edit my videos, um, so that's why the last two videos that I've come out with has not had my intro and outro in it. My phone. For some reason, I've been deleting almost every app I have. Um, I've been deleting picture after picture and all that stuff. And every time I try to record on my phone, it only goes for about a minute or two. My videos are longer than that. As you can see, we're already up to 9 minutes and 16 seconds. Um, so, yeah, my videos go longer than that. So, I can't do it off of my phone. And then on top of that, uh, every time I try to edit and all that stuff, in my phone, it continuously tells me that I don't have enough storage and stuff and all that, so I don't know what the fuck's going on there. And then, um, whenever I, I try, I downloaded this editing app on my phone, I mean on my, uh, computer, the first one, and that did not work. And then, like, every time I would go to post it on, um, YouTube, it would tell me, uh, that the video needs to be backed up or something. I don't know what it was asking. But then the second one, my friend Michael uh, told me to download this one app. And I downloaded it. And I literally waited nine hours. That's why that video that I did yesterday that you guys watched didn't come out till so late. Because where it freaking uh, took not literally eight or nine hours um, to download. And then at the end of it, it told me, sorry, this video cannot be downloaded or something, uh, an error has occurred or something. So I waited nine hours for nothing and then had to hurry up and post it like that. So I, again, I apologize. This video today is going to have no intro or outro, but let me know in the comments below um, what is a good editing app to use for your computer. My cousin, um, my cousin, uh, he has a YouTube channel too. Uh, his name is the What Up Gamer. Um, yeah. God, stop doing that, Pat. Dang. 
I'm on YouTube. Well, I'm making a video for YouTube, but anyways, my pad just scared the hell out of me. But anyways, um, um, well, oh yeah, my cousin, uh, his name is the What Up Gamer on YouTube. Um, his uh, he suggested a ad app for me to use. Um, it's called Shotcut or something like that. Uh, he told me about it. That's the one that he uses. Uh, I tried to get that. They do not have that on my piece of crap laptop. So I am in a pickle. I have no idea what app um, to download to use to edit my videos on here. Uh, so if you could, let me know in the comments below what to use. Because I, at this point, I have no idea. Uh, and I'm going to get back into it. <sighs> Hang on. I'm going to answer a couple more questions for you guys. <clears throat> It says, what is the most um, heartwarming thing you've ever seen? Um, I think the most heartwarming thing I've ever seen was um, when Hurricane Harvey hit uh, Texas and J.J. Watt raised 30 30 some million dollars for uh, Houston. I thought that was just so awesome that he did that. And he's hoping that kind of or that city get back on their feet, um, you know, and all that. Uh, and Hurricane Irma and Hurricane Jose and all the hurricanes, um, those places need help too. But the heartwarming thing that I seen was JJ Watt raise all that money for Houston. Uh, I thought that was pretty awesome. But, um, says, what is the most annoying question that people ask you? Um, um I don't even know. I don't even know, to be honest. All right, here we go. We're having back into it. The yellow ones are sad. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to break them up in the colors. And then my handfuls are going to be the full color. Stupid freaking flies. Sorry. I had a mosquito on my computer. Mm. Mm. Hang on, I'm right back. Alright, sorry I keep on going away, but like I told you guys, let's go. Um, let's see, it says, it says, 
what could you give a 40 minute I have no idea how to answer that, so I'm going to skip it. It says, if you were a director of a small island, um, if you was a director of a small island, uh, Nathan, uh, what crazy director stuff would you do? Um... I don't know. Uh, dude, what the fuck? Hang on. Um, uh, I don't know. Um, I mean, swimming, uh, of course. I don't know if I was a director of, a, I guess, an island clip. Here's the purple, so I'm going in. Damn it. Dropped another one, damn it. Um. Did the purple ones or so? Right, but I'm gonna hop back in the questions. Uh, okay. Uh, I said, what is something you think everyone should know at least once in their lifetime? Hmm. What is something? you think everyone should know, should do at least once in their lifetime um what is something you think everyone should do at least once in their lifetime um i don't know there there's a lot of stuff to do um uh Go skydiving. I don't know. Uh, no, nah, probably not that. That that's that's dangerous. But hey, I mean, we only live once, you know. But uh, 
Do not go skydiving. Um, I mean, I wouldn't. If you guys want to, then that's your choice. I can't tell you what to do, but I would not go skydiving. Um, I'm not going bungee jumping either. Uh, I would say, what should everyone do at least once in their lifetime? Um, go to a badass water park. That's that's what I want to do. Now, I'm not speaking for you guys. If you guys want to go skydiving, bungee jumping, riding on a bull, uh, do anything like that, that's your guys' choice. But if I had to do one thing that I want to do at least one time in my lifetime is go to an insane water park. I've seen this water park in, um, in Germany, and it's really cool. Uh, it's a water park. They have... Uh, Balloon, they have, uh, uh, what the heck are those, uh, 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 hot air balloon rides, they have those, um, yeah, they have a lot of cool shit at that water park, um, I would love to go there, um, I say, yeah, that's what I want to do, is visit a really, really cool water park, let's see, what's the next colors I'm going to be eating, let's do pink, uh, my tongue is already hurting from this. But here we go. Next one's up. Um. Um. Uh, all right, I'm yet. Uh. Um. All right, here's some more questions. Um. All right, what would you rather go? Um, would you rather go hang, hand gli hang gliding or white water rafting? To be honest, um, I would rather go white water rafting. I think that looks pretty awesome now. I know it's dangerous and everything, um, but that looks really, really cool. Um... I'm saving the best for last. The yellows are up in there. Those yellows are sour. Um, but yeah, I would rather go uh, white water rafting. Um, what is your dream car? A Mustang. Always has been. Um, what's worth spending more on to get the best? 
um, I don't know how to answer that question, so I'm just gonna skip that. It says, what is something that tons of people are obsessed with, but you just don't get the point of it? Um, uh, I would have to say Team Wolf or something. Uh, some of, uh, like, um, Teen Wolf and... Um, Vampire Diary and all that stuff. People is in love with those shows. I just don't get the point to them. Man, I I tried to get into those. I cannot get into those. But anyways, here we go. On to the green. And then I got the yellow. And then I'm done. Um. So anyways, here we go. Um, and the green is sour. The green is sour. At the end of this, I'm going to show you guys my tongue. All right. All right, I'm going to answer some more questions before getting on to the yellow. Oh, that yellow is going to suck ass. Um, um, it says, what are you most looking forward to? two in the next ten years. Getting my own place. Um moving in with my fiance. Um starting a family. Um hanging out with my family. With my family here. Um hanging out with her family. Um going places, exploring places. I wanna go to Hawaii. Me and her are getting married. Um Next year, I might vlog some of the wedding for you guys. Um, I might vlog some of it and uh, capture some of it for you guys. Um, and I'm definitely, uh, wherever we go on our honeymoon, I'm going to be vlogging that for you guys for sure. Uh, but I'm hoping to go to Hawaii for our honeymoon. Um, but yeah, that's what I want to do. But... I'm going to hop into it. I am so not looking forward to this. But fuck it. I mean, but screw it. Sorry. Like I told you yesterday, this is kid friendly. I'm trying to stop cussing. Sorry about all the cussing. I really need to stop cussing. Um, but yeah, let me know in the comments below what you guys think is a good editing app. Because I really want to put my intro and outro in these videos. I don't want them just to be like... 30, 40, 50 minutes long, uh, which is pretty damn long still, but I don't want them to just be like that and then, you know, hop straight into the video. I want an intro. I want my intro and outro in there, um, you know, and all that, because I'm pretty sure that all the new people, you guys already know that I want you to like it up, uh, subscribe and all that, but all the new people that come in here and watch these videos, 
they're just watching a full video. They don't have an intro. They're not watching my intro, spinning my name around NFL Boy Brandon. And then at the end of it, it's not telling them, thank you for watching, subscribe, um, you know, blah, 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 all that stuff. It's not telling them that because I don't have my intro and outro because I can't find a good editing yet for this. So let me know down in the comments below what, uh, what you guys think I should use. Oh yeah, by the way, I will be going live today. Oh. Mm. That's just stupid. That's just stupid. My tongue hurts. Alright, um, ah, my tongue hurts. That's why my tongue looks like, but, um, but yeah, um, what I wanted to tell you guys is that I am going to be going live today. I don't know what game I'm going to be playing and all that. I might be playing WWE. I might not. I'm gonna try to go live today. Um, and then um, um, I know that these videos that I've been doing, the last two or three videos, have been ripoffs. Um, I know that this one was not uh, the Warheads, so I'm gonna go find some Warheads. And I am in the future going to do an actual Warhead challenge, like I wanted to. And then I know the noodles that I did was not actually Korean fire noodle, cha uh, Korean fire noodles. And I told you that, guys, at the start. And I told you guys that at the start. But I am gonna go off of you, off of uh, not YouTube, off of uh, Amazon, and I am gonna buy some Korean fire noodles, and I'm gonna eat those for you. And then I know the video that I did yesterday with the uh, nuclear habanero or habanero, uh, 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 noodles that I ate was not the actual noodles, those was, a, those was really nasty, and I think why they was nasty, it wasn't a point that it was nasty, nasty, it was a point that the mushroom sauce did not go well with the takis and stuff, so that did not work out well, so now I know that I will not be trying that anymore. And they actually have nuclear haba, nuclear habanero um, noodles on Amazon. A five pack for them is seventeen dollars, so I will be buying those as well. So everything that I've been doing have been ripped off type things because I can't find them down here where I'm at. But I will be doing those for you guys um, in the future. I'm gonna answer about two or three more questions before I go. And I'm gonna hop off and upload this. Um, it says, "What is the most interesting place you've been?" Again, the only place I've ever been is to California. Uh, well, I've been places around uh, where I live. So uh, there's a place called High Bridge. Um, near where I live, and I think that's pretty cool. Um, so I'd probably say that. Um, it 
It says, what's something you've been meaning to try, but just haven't got around to it? Um, I've been meaning to try the Korean fire noodles, the Havana fire noodles, the, you know, um, I also in the future want to do a Big Mama challenge too. Um, if you all haven't ever heard of Big Mamas, they're like, um, if you all have ever heard of them, I don't know if they sell them where you guys are, but we have a thing called, um, called, um, pickled, uh, pickled bologna and, uh, pickled bologna, um, they have the, lo these long, uh, sausages that look like hot dogs and whatnot, and they're pickled, and that's basically what Big Mama tastes like, it's pickled and hot at the same time, and I want to eat a bunch of those for you guys, um, and make it a challenge, uh, but yeah, um, I want to do that. I want to eat the Korean fire noodles. I want to do all that. Um, it says, what's the best thing that happened to you last week? Um, probably getting to hang out with my girlfriend. Um, going to the movies, seeing it, I think that happened last week. Um, wait, what is today? Uh... Friday? No, we went Tuesday, so that wasn't last week. Um, I don't know. Um, hanging out with my girlfriend, my family, uh, all that. Uh, what piece of... Damn it. Sorry, I got an update off of the score. Um, it says, if all jobs had the same pay an hour... What job would you like to have? Um, if all work had the same pay rate, that would not be right. Because some jobs are harder than the other. So, um, what I want to do is I'm going to go to college to get my business license to become a, um, to become a business person. Um, and I'm going to open up my own restaurant. And I'm going to open up my own restaurant. Um... And, yeah, um, I think it would also be really cool to be an athletic trainer in the NFL, so I, uh, so that would be really cool, uh, but yeah, I'm gonna go to school, get my business license, and start up my own restaurant, that's what I'm planning on doing, um, Um, it says, what amazing thing did you do that no one was around to see? Um, something that I just did really cool. You know how, uh, let me find it. Yeah, here we go. You see how these things are right here? Well, well, I had you guys up there. I had one of those stuck in my teeth and I got it out. Went straight down here and it went through one of these cracks and, the, um, and, the, uh, and, uh, uh, through the porch, it went, it went through one of the crates in the porches, which is pretty damn awesome, um, it says, how, how different was your life one year ago, um, it wasn't very much different, I was with Rebecca, um, we hadn't been together that long. Hold on, let me see. What is this on September? Um, so June. Hold on. We've been together for about four months. Um, so yeah, we hadn't been together for very long. Um, I don't know. Uh, wait, is it 2000? Wow, I'm numb. It's 2017. Wow, what the f is wrong with me right now? Uh, we had been together for long. We got together in 2016. I mean, 2015. 
So we had been together for over a year. I think it was a year and four months. Um, so yeah, um, nothing really. Um, what's the best way to start the day? Uh, waking up, having some coffee, uh, watching TV, playing video games. I normally get up, play some video games and stuff. Um, uh, it says, what would you rate 10... says, what would you rate 10, 10? I don't know what the heck that question is, so I'm going to go past that. It says, what fade or trend do you hope comes back? Uh, I don't know. What's the most inter interesting piece of art you've seen? Um... I don't know. There's a lot of coins. I like the Mona Lisa. Um... Oh, there's a lot of cool pieces. Um, what kind of art do you enjoy most? I don't know. What do you hope never changes? Um, me and Rebecca being together, uh, I hope that me and my family never stop talking. Uh, I hope her and her family never stop talking. Uh, I hope me and her never break up. You know, all that stuff. I hope that doesn't change or anything. Uh, what city would you most like to live in if I was not living in this city right now? Um, I would probably be living in either Australia or Hawaii, and it would probably be Australia, to be honest, because I like Australia. Uh, dude, I love their accents. I don't know why, but I love their accents. Um, what movie title best describes your life? Um, I don't know, we're funny and silly, and we love each other, so I don't know, um, I don't know, um, I don't know, I keep on thinking the Step Brothers, but I don't remember a part to where they loved each other at, you know? Like, I don't remember them hugging and saying, oh, I love you and all this stuff. Well, actually, they did up in the treehouse. So, yeah, I guess, I guess, I guess, um, stepbrothers and all that. Why, why did you decide to do the work you are going, are doing now? Uh, well, mm, the work I am doing now is trying to make my YouTube channel big, um, and I'm doing it because I love you guys, you know. Uh, I love doing this. I, I love, I love all of it, you know, and all that. So, uh, what is the best way a person can spend their time? Uh, like I said, watching TV, hanging outside, drinking some coffee. Uh, I don't know. Um, if you suddenly became a monster, uh. A monster at woodwork, what would you make? Um, mm, what would I make? Um, I don't know. If I became a master at woodwork, I'd probably make a, a tree house. Huh? Mm -mm. Sorry guys, that was my mom asking me a question real quick. What is the most... Yeah, I would make a treehouse, probably. If I automatically just became like a, uh, a uh, professional woodwork person. What is the most relaxing place you've ever been? Uh... Probably Highbridge. Or somewhere is out in the country or, or something. That that stuff is relaxing now. I would not like to live out in the country. 
because I'm a city boy and all that. I cannot, I do not like it out there in the country and all that stuff. Um, but, uh, but yeah, but the country is relaxing and stuff. Um, what is the luckiest thing that has happened to you? Uh, having an amazing family, meeting the love of my life. Um, just, uh, um, getting to know God more, um, uh, you know, uh, all that stuff, you know, uh, where would you, where would you rather be, where would you rather be from, um, I don't understand that question, where would I rather be from, uh, Australia, because I love their accents, I guess. Um, what are some things you've had to, you've had to unlearn? What? Don't get that question, so I'm going to skip it. What are you looking forward to in the coming months? Um, getting married to my, uh, fiance, like I was telling you guys, um, uh, our wedding, um, our wedding is, um, our wedding is, uh, coming up real soon. It's going to be on June 16th of 2018, which is, hold on, let me see. I actually got it counting down on my calendar. Hang on, let me see. Um, it is in 90 days from now is when me and her are going to get married. Um, in 90 days from now, um, so I'm really excited about that, um, um, yeah, that's coming in the next couple of months, um, going to a water park, going to Newport Aquarium, um, going to tons of places like that, um, Uh, what website do you visit the most often? Um, there's a lot of them. I visit, uh, you now, uh, uh, app set, um, called you now. I think what I'm going to start doing is every once a week, um, every once or twice a week, um, every once or twice a week, I'm going to go live on you now just to, actually, I might make it three or four times a week, just to, um, just to, uh, build up my YouTube, and because I like, you know, you know, I've been live on there once before, and I liked it, the only thing I didn't like is I was trying to do a pay-per-view, and people couldn't see it because the TV swept up, but, uh, but yeah, I might just chill like this, hang out, um, hang out and talk to, uh, them on there, so if you guys want to go on you now, uh, search Brandon McDonald and become a fan of me on there, um, create an account, you have to be, I think you have to be 13 or older to make a, uh, you, um, app, and when you go on there, do not joke about, um, you being younger, because moderators will actually kick you the hell out, um, you know, so do not do that, um, but yeah, um, get, go make that, um, I, I watch YouTube all the time, um, and all that stuff, uh, my favorite YouTuber right now is a person called Nikocado Avocado, he makes really hilarious, uh, videos and stuff, uh, he's a mukbanger, he, he, I enjoy watching him eat because he talks about a lot of funny stuff and all that stuff know that, um, but yeah, um, let's see, uh, it says, what's one thing do you really want, but you can't afford, um, one thing I really want, but I can't afford, um, hush it, Nemo, Nemo, hush it, uh, Probably, uh, a car. Nemo! Hush it! Nemo! 
hush it up. Sorry, my dog's over there barking and everything. Um, but yeah, probably a car. Well, I mean, me and Rebecca are gonna get a car in October, but uh, yeah, that that'd be about it. A car, maybe a motorcycle, something like that. Um, where do you usually go when you? Uh, oh yeah, one thing I wanted to talk to you guys about. Um, if I was to start up. A um a uh PayPal account. How many of you guys would give me money or something? Or let me know in the comments below. Would you rather me set up a PayPal account or a Patreon? I don't know how to set up a Patreon, but I would go on about doing it in every every week or two. Whoever pays for the Patreon, I would send. I would do something special just on the Patreon for you guys, um, I would probably, uh, I would probably do a special video of me saying somewhere insanely crazy, um, and upload it just on Patreon, I would not make it for YouTube, nothing, I would make one insane video, uh, of me staying crazy places, um, and upload them just on just on, um, Patreon, um, for whoever is subscribed to me, or whoever is on there for me and all that, um, uh, I don't even know, I don't even know if I'm gonna do that, I'm debating whether I want to do it or not, I'm probably not going to do it, um, but I'm saying, would you guys support me if I did do that, um, It says, where do you usually go when you, when you, when you have time off? Um, I don't know. I go a lot of places. One of the places that I really want to go, but I haven't been for a couple of months, um, is, uh, um, uh, to, uh, a, a pup golf course. Uh, I really want to go to a pup golf course, but I haven't been for a while. But I want to go there again. That was pretty fun. Um, where would you spend all your time if you could? Um, I don't know. Either at a swimming pool. Uh, probably at a gym, to be honest. Because you got a swimming pool, a sauna, all that. Dude, I need to start up my thing again at the gym, damn it. Um, it says, what is special about you, about the place you grew up? Um, that this is where we have been living for 13, 14, 12, 13, or 14 years now. Um, I have a lot of childhood memories here at this house. Um, all that stuff. Uh, what age do you want to live to? Um, 85, 90, 95, somewhere in there. Somewhere in there. That, that would be great to live that long. Now, do I think I am? Probably not. Uh, I'll probably live up to my 80s or something, but after that, probably not. Um, what are you most like? What are you most likely to become famous for? Uh, hopefully, I'm hoping uh, on YouTube, making these YouTube videos like I am right now. Uh, I'm hoping to become famous off of this. Um, well, not famous. Sorry, let me put it a different way. I'm not trying to become famous. I would love to start getting paid by YouTube off of doing this um, for, for you guys, um, uh, but do I care about famous? Now, I've told you guys before, the 46 subscribers that I have in here, or have right now, um, all I care about is entertaining you guys, doing all that stuff, um, that's all I care about. Um, let me see, what do you wish you knew more about? Um, I think we already had that question. What, what, what question would you most like 
to know the answer to. Um, um, I don't know, to be honest. What question can you ask to find out the most about a person? Um, that is a really, really good one. Hold on, let me think. Uh, this is where I'm going to cap it off. It says, what question can you find, uh, find out the, what question can you ask to find out the most about, about a person? Um, I don't even know, to be honest. That is a really good question. Um, hang on, I don't even know. Hold on, I'm going to ask my grandma. Grandma! Grandma! Hang on. Let me call her and get her out here. Hold on. Come here, the YouTube world wants to know something. All right, I got a good question. I don't know how to answer it, all right? The question is, what is one thing that you can ask someone to know the most about them? That's impossible, ain't it? That that is a hard politics question. Politics or religion? Huh? Politics or religion? Either one of those. Grandma says those. Mm. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Um. To know the most about them, I don't know. Mm. I, don't know I guess you could ask them what their beliefs on religion is. To know the most about them, I don't know. Uh, let me know in the section below what do you guys think is uh is the most what? Hold on, I'm gonna read it right. It says. Hang on. It says, what, what question can you ask to find out the most about a person? Let me know down in the comments below. I guess mine would probably be what their what their beliefs on a religion is and all that stuff. Uh, how old they are, all that kind of stuff. Um, to find out the most about them, uh, you can ask them multiple questions. Uh, I don't know how to answer that one just in particular, but let me know down in the comments below what you guys think, um, what you guys believe, um, and all that stuff, but, uh, but yeah, <sighs> get a freaking mosquito bite on me, uh, but yeah, I'm gonna hop up out of here, peace!